Hey bud. Oh, do I have a collection of videos I'm gonna add absolutely no value to today. Come for the videos and stay for the, stay for the me. If you're on TikTok, you know that the For You is already tailored to you. So why do you need to see videos that I think are funny? You're already being shown videos that you think are funny. I don't know, maybe you're on TikTok and everything it shows you is just cute animals. Thotties dancing in front of a mirror. Musicians. <laughs> Maybe your for you isn't delivering that phenomenal comedy content. Luckily, that's all I get, so I got you covered. There's a good chance that if you find any of these videos funny, you'll find my videos entertaining, and you know, maybe we'll be friends. Wanna? <laughs> Quick question though, bud, before we get going. What do you think of the TV off? Lately, I've been putting like stuff on the screen to make it like more of an interesting background. Is it distracting that way, or distracting this way? That was a good one, what a sport. That's how you raise a kid right there. You don't run over to them, oh my God, are you okay? With like a crazy mom raising a total snowflake. You just say, hey, flip that car back around, pop that dislocated shoulder back in and get back on the old John Deere there. Go for a rip. Blah! Tell me what you majored in in college and then tell me what you do now. I studied psychology in the hopes of helping crazy people. Now I sit in a forest, play music on a UFO, talking to people who don't exist, and I realize I'm the crazy one. I don't know, bud. <laughs> yeah, you're just living your best life, first of all. Second of all, you seem very self-aware, so I'm gonna say that you're not crazy. But yeah, on the surface, this is kind of a crazy. Just wondering, do you support like a, like a type of legit pick a pick a LGB. Oh, LGBTQ. Nah, that's cool. Is it is it cool or do you feel like you're supposed to say that? If you have to ask, then you don't support it. Uh hon, in 2021, is this something we have to pretend to care about now? Wait, the camera's rolling, right? Yeah, we definitely care about that. I'm gonna be a boxing blueberry. What's gonna do with all that junk? All that junk inside that trunk. <laughs> Hilarious and adorable. Blueberry. I'm a beatboxing blueberry. I wanna be the very best, like no one ever was, okay, people? Uh, Donald, no, no, that's, uh, that's not your speech. Quiet, Barack, I'm talking, thank you. We will travel across the lands, searching far and wide. Uh, isn't that the Pokemon theme song? No, it's not. We gotta catch them all. We have to catch all of them. And we're gonna put them behind the wall. I mean, I'm still getting those Diamond and Pearl remakes. In a world we must defend from China. Impressions 10 out of 10. Facial expressions 10 out of 10. Writing 10 out of 10. That's pure talent right there. So I'm gonna make sure to tag all of these talented content creators down below. Make sure to check out their channels because they're funny people. 911. Somebody's really drunk driving down Cranton Road. Which way are they going? They are going, um... Towards Granton or towards Nailsville? Towards Granton. Okay, are you behind them or...? No, I am them. You am them? Yes, I am them. Okay, so you want to call and report that you're driving drunk? Yes. Are you still driving right now? Yes. Do you want to stop driving before you get in an accident? Yes, I will stop. Can I take my seatbelt off? If you're stopped. Can I turn my car off and turn, turn the flashers on? Yep, that's fine. If you want to turn it off and turn the flashers on, so then we can find you. Happy Star Wars Day, everyone. Today is also my birthday. And because it's my birthday, I get to introduce you to my girlfriend. Happy Star Wars Day, everyone. Today is also my birthday. And Star Wars Day, everyone. Today is also my birthday.
Boris Day, everyone. Today is also my birthday. And because it's my birthday, everyone, today is also my birthday. And because it's my birthday, today is also my birthday. And because it's my birthday, I get to introduce you to my girlfriend. Marcus, you don't want to do this. Let her go. Breaking news, a man is currently holding his girlfriend hostage. Police are outside of his home waiting negotiation term. Breaking news, a man is currently holding his girlfriend hostage. Police are outside of his home waiting negotiation terms. This creativity, it just doesn't exist anywhere else. It's, it's so impressive to build this story, this little world around this one cringy video. Just when you think they're not gonna be able to add anything of value. <laughs> It's cranked up. All right, here's a scenario for you, Dad. Suppose Nancy sees me coming out of the shower and decides to come on me. And I'm looking good. I got a luscious V of hair coming from my chest pubes down to my ball fro. And she takes one look at me and goes, oh my God, I've had the old bull. Now I want the young calf. So she grabs me by the wiener. Shut the fuck up! John C. Riley? Is, is that his name? That is such a good impression. I really thought that they were using the movie audio there for a second. That was so sweet. Apparently I've never been on a highline before. And apparently I never get to go on a highline because my grandpa's always watching the highline bowl. And apparently there's this time I apparently would try to go on one of these and apparently my grandpa said I couldn't because he said he went on one when he was a kid and he got scared half to death. Cross that gap? What a savage. That's so scary. And he did it well doing an impression. You think you're so tough? Well, we all know you're just a man drink mimicking. <laughs> yeah? That's not what your mother said last night. What the fuck did you just say? <laughs> Come again, mate. I said, that's not what your mother said last night. Well, 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 your mother's so hideous, I wouldn't touch her with a 10-foot jousting pole. <laughs> <laughs> well, no. your mother is so hideous that people often mistake her for your brother. Oh, which brother? Thomas. You sack of wine. The girth of your mother's waistline is so vast, you have to take a three-day ride to get to her good side. <laughs> your, your mother? Your, your m m mother? Out of it. Your mother! Shut up! Damn it, Ben! Well, your mother is so ugly. Oi. That back at the king. That skit could have been a whole show. I, I could have watched that for so long. Better go get you some gas. What? I said you better go get you some gasoline while you still can. Why? Cause Biden, that's why. Really? There was a cyberborg attack on the old place and uh, Biden initiated it. What? Yeah, but it's about to be two, three hundred dollars a gallon, so you better go fill up while you can. How? I done told you, cause Biden. Biden, that's why. What? Everything's got to be political in the States. Every comment section, doesn't matter what it is. Can you handle not making a political reference for one whole day? If, if you can do that challenge, I don't know, hit me up on IG. Send me a DM and be like, I did it. I did it. I'm the first American ever to not talk about politics for one day. I would love it. Cause Biden! <laughs> hey, what are you looking at? I'm looking at something fine and spectacular. <laughs> some juicy, some delicious, some scrum diddly umptious. Something only God created. I'm looking at something so fine. It's certified, bona fide, and qualified, baby. Give me a man congregation. Go off. They're supposed to watch these videos and not say anything anymore. Gorgeous women does something hypersexual and we're all just, we're not even allowed to be like, you look good. You look very pretty today. Let's bring back manly Christians. Let's bring, let's bring back <clears throat> men. When men were men. Whatever happened to bros being bros, huh? Hmm? Love these men. No homo. This guy. He's an angel, but first and foremost, he's a Christian man. What is he here? Is he a man? Is he a Christian? Is he a God-fearing man? This man right here, he's standing in fire, but he don't care. No why? Because he's a Christian man. If you're not dressing like your horse, I'm not sure you are a man. I question you. So true. When were Christians manly men? Like, what era did we skip over? What point in the, in the history of Christianity were Christians, were, were they alphas? Why do you work out? What? 
Why do you work out? To look cooler during sex. Not for health reasons. No, you gotta have sex and look cool at the same time. But you should work out because it, it's healthy for your heart. That's right. Live longer, have more cool looking sex. But looking cool during sex doesn't really matter. You gotta look cool all the time, sir. You work out because it's it's good for you. It's good to look cool during sex. It's even cooler when you're healthy. Whatever. That's fine. I trust you. Okay. This is different. You're not gonna look cooler during sex. I'm built there. Nice clip. Thank you. Don't you want to be healthy and live longer? Yeah, like whatever, sure. Like if, if 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 you say that, then I trust you that that is the way that it works. But I don't know. As far as I as far as I know, it's about looking cooler during sex. So. In the driver's defense, like her head is not even past the bed of the truck. There's no way that he would be able to see her back there. And she's driving right in the middle of a parking lot. Oh, the comments on this are so money. This sounds like the paper towel dispenser. When you walk past a motion sensor Halloween decoration. My cat when she's in heat. My door when I come home late. Get on the sidewalk, you old coot. Who says coot? Hey, 2021 has a comment. That was absolutely terrifying for her. Okay, you were raised by a Karen. I was raised by a mother that pulled me out of school for a day to go foraging for plants in the woods. Ellie, it's a full moon. You need to take this more seriously. Mom. It's a full moon, you better take this seriously. You're making your, your Tic Tacs over there, you know? We're missing key spell witching hour. The condescension and seriousness in her voice. It was the perfect filter. I don't know why the big eyes just added so much to this. I guess because it made him look like more of a little kid. <laughs> we watch a karate movie and we are ninjas for a period of time. We watch a hockey game and now we're, we're Sidney Crosby on the street for the next two days. You don't want to turn your back on me after I watch Ninja Turtles. That's it. Thanks for hanging out, guys. Again, let me know what you think of the TV, on or off. Let me know in the comments. Deuces. Oh,